Hello video editors. Welcome back to Solid Tutorials. This marks chapter 7 of our After Effects 2023 complete tutorial series. In this chapter, we'll explore four different methods to remove backgrounds from various videos. I'll guide you through each one step by step. In our first approach, we'll dive into removing a green screen background in After Effects. You can find the practice files I'll be using in this tutorial linked in the video description below. Let's start by dragging and dropping a green screen video onto the timeline. As you can see, it has a green background that we need to remove. To achieve this, navigate to the Effects and Presets panel and expand the keying section. Within this section, select the key light effect and apply it to your video. Now, head over to the Effect Controls panel and fine-tune the key light effect settings. Inside the key light effect, you'll notice a black box, click on it. By choosing a color here, you'll instruct After Effects to remove that specific color from your video. Let's select the green color corresponding to our background. Instantly, you'll see the green background vanish from our video. If you ever need to undo any changes, simply use Ctrl plus Z. But there's an even simpler way to pick and remove background colors. Next to the color boxes, you'll find the picker tool, click on it, and then click on the green screen background. It's that easy. After removing the green screen background, you can further refine your result by adjusting settings such as Dispill Bias Color and Alpha Bias Color. Additionally, explore the Screen Matte section within the Keylight effect, which can enhance your green screen background removal. The Keylight effect offers numerous settings to enhance your project further. You can apply a pre-blur effect around the subject. Utilize inside and outside masks. Perform foreground color correction. And even fine-tune edge color correction for cropping green screen subjects. Once you're satisfied with your background removal, you can seamlessly replace it with a new video or image background. I'll demonstrate by dragging and dropping a background video into the timeline. Remember, placing the background video on the bottom layer will keep it in the background while your green screen subject remains in the foreground. So there you have it. This is how you can remove and change the background of any green screen video in After Effects. Now, let's explore another method in After Effects for removing backgrounds from videos that don't have a green screen. I have a video in the Project Media folder, and I'll drag and drop it onto the timeline. As you can see, this video has a complex background with various colors and patterns. To remove this background, we'll use the Roto Brush tool. First, double-click on the video. Then go to Tools at the top and select the Roto Brush tool. Using the Roto Brush, carefully trace around the subject in your video, just like this. This will create a selection around your subject, allowing you to effectively remove the background. Now, you might encounter situations where your selection extends beyond the subject, causing some extra, misplaced areas to be included. To fix this, use the Roto Brush tool while holding down the Alt key to remove these excess selections. This ensures that your selection accurately surrounds the subject while eliminating any unwanted extras. Be attentive to these adjustments as needed.
Once you're confident in your subject selection, proceed to the composition window. You'll find your video with the background removed. If you need to fine-tune details, like hair or a hat, within the subject's background, it's easily achievable. For instance, in this video, I want to remove the background while retaining detail in the hair and hat area. To do this, return to the selection layer window and choose the Refine Edge tool. Use this tool to precisely select the areas you wish to refine, such as the hair and cap region. During this process, your preview window may not provide an optimal view or you may encounter other issues. To avoid these problems, go to the View tab and adjust the resolution according to your computer's capabilities. Once you've made these adjustments, return to the Composition window. With these steps, you can effectively remove the video background without a green screen. This method empowers you to remove and change complex backgrounds in videos without a green screen, making it a valuable technique in After Effects. Afterward, you can easily replace it with any video or image background of your choice. Now, let's explore the third method to remove backgrounds in After Effects, and it's quite straightforward. Suppose you have videos with a black background, like neon particles. To remove this black background, drag the video onto the timeline. Right-click on the video layer, and access the blending mode options. Within this box, you'll find numerous blending mode options, each serving a different purpose. Our aim here is to remove the black background, so select the screen option in the blending mode. This option effectively removes the black background, making it an excellent choice for this type of video. Now, let's try removing a white background using a similar blending mode technique. Drag and drop the white background video onto the timeline, Right-click on it, and access the Blending Mode options. Try options like Multiply. Overlay, and more to see if they work for your video. While some of these options are effective for removing certain white video backgrounds, such as Multiply and Overlay, Let's explore a more reliable method for removing white backgrounds. In trick number 4, I'll show you how to remove any white background effectively in After Effects. Start with a video on the timeline, then head to Effects and Presets, and search for the Linear Key Effect. Apply this effect to the white background video by dragging and dropping it. Within the Effect Controls, select White as the key color. As soon as you choose the color from your video, it will be removed as the background. You can also remove the background by selecting a color directly within the composition window using the picker tool. Within the effect controls, you can fine tune the effect further, adjusting settings like tolerance, softness, and key operation. This allows you to remove backgrounds from videos of different colors using the same effect. For example, I'll apply the same linear key effect to a black background video. After applying the effect, Make further adjustments in the effect controls to suit your video background.
With this, we've completed our fourth method. I hope these four methods prove helpful for removing backgrounds from videos, whether they have a green screen or not, in After Effects. If you've found this tutorial useful, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. Share this video with your friends, so they can benefit from it as well. If you have any questions or need assistance with background removal, please feel free to ask in the comments section. Stay tuned to Solly Tutorials for more excellent tutorial videos like this. Take care, and goodbye.